for part of English, English, English arts up here, English speaking arts, so to speak. We work in American productions. And some of us move down there, and I don't want to divide the world into white guys and indigenous guys. That's not the point. No. But if I'm a white guy and I move to LA or to New York, I have to slightly Americanize myself to, to work in their system. I don't mean just get rid of the out and abouts. I mean, I've seen it happen to Henry Cherney. I've seen it happen to a number of gone down. Not they people. had a great career, but they kind of, I don't say they become Americanized, but they're slight, the reflexes are different. Okay, yeah. for the white guys and the white women. Well, you, but being an indigenous guy, yeah. do you have to Americanize yourself as you go into that kind of acting style? No, why should I? I'm me. I mean, you always, every, everybody, everything bends to the environment that it chooses to grow in. If you see a tree going to grow up straight and there's a limb in its way, it'll grow that way, it'll follow that. And that's what happens to a lot of people. A lot of people I know move to British Columbia because that's where all the work was. Not knowing that the money comes from here, goes out there. And likewise in Los Angeles, a lot of Canadian actors went to Los Angeles for a while. And then the government uh, was trying to figure out how to root these people out, actors of all people, dangerous criminals, you know, dangerous, gotta get rid of them. So they held the Department of Immigration opened an office downtown LA and advertised in a Variety about this movie that was being cast. They, they, they needed people with Canadian accents. Of course, all the Canadian actors went over there. <laughs> what? They went to, the, went to this audition and they said, do you have a green card? And he says, well, no, I don't. I was waiting to get a job before I could uh, come with us. Bang, you're back to Canada. Bang, you're back to Canada. It's just stupid, stupid things. Wait a minute, it's U.S. immigration set that up? Yeah. To kind of like the honey trap and get all those Canadians out? Yeah. What was this? Oh, well, they're taking jobs away from our American uh, actors, you know. How long ago was this? Probably 10, 15 years ago. Oh, I've never heard that story. Wow. Oh, there. Now you have it. Wow. Straight from the horse's butt. Wow. Did you go? No, I was up here. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have went anyway. Wow. <laughs> Get those Canadian actors out of here. Yeah, we're going to find a way to trap them. Why do you want to do that?